Oh man, R.I.P. Jerry. Okay, we're gonna make him a nice uh, little uh, plaque up there, a little grave. Uh, he's gonna enjoy it, or well, he would have enjoyed it. He's uh, in llama heaven right now, whatever that is. <laughs> YouTube, Komodo Gaming here, bringing you guys another episode of Minecraft, and unfortunately, folks, we have a terrible thing to do here today, because we are going to be remembering a friend. Now, if you recall from the last episode, we had a tragic accident that happened here with one of Larry's family members. Buddy. Come on, you're almost there. C come on. Come on, you got this. You got this. This is all you, Jerry. Come on. Come on, just a little bit of assistance here. Come on, Jerry. Jerry, just just come up this. I see your head poking up. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on, Jerry. Let's go. Here, look, I'm jumping with you. Oh, there we go. Oh, why is this, <laughs> this why is this working? Come on. Come on, Jerry. Oh. And yes, uh, we're gonna set up a memorial today for Jerry. But that's not all what we're gonna do. We're actually gonna start on our next build for the tower. Hold on, there's no trap set up for me, is there? I get paranoid every time I walk in my tower now. I feel like the boys are setting up traps for me. So I did manage to actually get the other two family members up here. So I want you to meet Terry and we have Bob and Bob's currently trying to set himself on fire. Stop that, Bob. So yeah, there's three llamas up here and yes, we're still short our poor Jerry, but you know what? Jerry's not gonna die in vain because if we go up to the next level, this is where we're gonna have the Jerry Memorial. Now this isn't it though. This is gonna be the start of the new build, and folks, we're gonna be building myself a burger suite. Now, we're not gonna finish it here today. We're gonna to try to get some of the frame up. Uh, you can see I have some parts and pieces here in my inventory because I want it to look like a burger. So you'll have the bun, you'll have the meat, you'll have the cheese, tomato, lettuce, and the top bun, and maybe some sesame seed uh, pieces at the top. But I've got to figure out how to do that because I have no clue what I'm doing. So I do have some stuff gathered here in the chest. Uh, we'll start that here in just a second, but uh, we have to go do something real quick. By the way, if you guys are enjoying Minecraft on the channel, be sure to hit that thumbs up button. And you know what? Go ahead and hit the thumbs up button for Jerry's memory. Hashtag Rip Jerry. Let's get it trending in my comment section. So, real quick, I've got a couple comments uh, to highlight from the last episode. One was what we're gonna do here. This is by Raphael. Uh, this says, change Jerry's leather piece in the anvil, call it Jerry, and we're gonna place a grave for Jerry. So thanks for that suggestion. Now, as far as I asked you guys last episode, this was before Jerry died, to make a joke uh, that would make me laugh, and I was gonna feature that, and I had one, and you know what? Jerry, he had a sense of humor, and he would have enjoyed this. It says, here's a joke. What do you call Larry's family? Dead. Don't worry, Jerry had a dark sense of humor. He would have laughed at this. Okay, well, here it is. Let's stick it in. All right, there we go, and this is going to be called Jerry. Oh man, R.I.P. Jerry. Okay, we're gonna make him a nice uh, little uh, plaque up there, a little grave. Uh, he's gonna enjoy it, or, well, he would have enjoyed it. He's uh, in llama heaven right now, whatever that is. Okay, so I've gathered more supplies uh, for the memorial. You know, we're gonna have to have a funeral. Maybe I'll invite Spy and Obi, uh, see if they wanna join me in memoring Jerry. So, I've got some leather here. This is not the Jerry leather. This down here is the Jerry leather. I need to make like a little plaque for him here. There we go, there's an item frame. So, there we go, put that there. I should be able to put his leather in there. So, we need to build a little grave here. I wanna center it. Uh, we'll build the stilts for the burger palace above this. We'll probably have two uh, maybe sets of stairs on each side, but you know what? Jerry's gonna be the focus here. He's gonna be like the focal point of the base of the stairs. So let's place the dirt here. Uh, also, by the way, if anybody has any nice words for Jerry, uh, let me know. I mean, I don't know what you can really say. We didn't know him for that long, but you know what? It's fine. Okay, so make a little cross there. We're gonna put the item frame right there, and we're gonna put Jerry right there. <laughs> oh, 
Oh, man. Jerry would like this. Okay, so I've got some flowers. I can use a couple of these. I was going to use some of these dandelions for a dye uh, for the cheese, but I can always find more. Uh, let's place some flowers here. Uh, I've got some roses. Uh, let's go ahead and stick these in here. There we go. Oh, this is beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Jerry would have liked this. He would have liked it a lot. There we go. So, we have a little Jerry memorial. Look at that. But you know what? Jerry would have wanted us to push on. So what we're going to do here, let's start to build the pillars of success. Also, I need some stairs. I need to go down and get some more cobblestone. Uh, let's see. How do we want to do the stairs here? I think, actually, let's do stone stairs. These are nice. I can go get more stone down at the bottom. Uh, I think these will actually be really good. Okay, so what we're going to do now, we're going to build the base of the tower. So I want to have stone here, and then I want to have the stone stairs. So let's go ahead and do a pillar on the front end, and then we're going to do the stairs on the back end. So they're going to probably be, let's go three wide on the stairs. So we'll go one, two, three, and they'll do the same thing on the other side. And we'll build them up, and this will lead into the bottom of the, uh, the burger tower. Not gonna lie, this section's coming out a little better than I pictured it was going to. And uh, yeah, this is gonna be nice looking. So let's go ahead and finish this off with the stairs. Uh, we'll put these sideways. There we go. So yeah, you've got like a nice little staircase over Jerry's grave. Look at that little sunset there. It's perfect. So yeah, this will be the start. So we'll go up. I'm probably gonna fence this whole area off. I need to go ahead and make pillars here get some torches and light it up and then this will be the base of the bun up here uh, this is where we'll start so it's gonna be odd uh, I want to layer the outside and make it look like a burger obviously uh, the inside is just gonna look like a normal house though or maybe we'll go a little more fancy than normal all right so I got my birch out all right so we have this so we're gonna stick these here so this is gonna be the outside the bottom hmm I guess it'll be stone so we'll have stone floors. Actually, let's go ahead and make uh, some more of the uh, stone brick. There we go. This will be a nice floor base. You won't see this from the outside. It's just going to be the floor itself. It's not going to be the outside layer. Okay, so it's the next morning. Let's go ahead and start to layer the floors, and then we'll figure out how this needs to work. You know what? I got a really good idea for this section. So here, let me cut this. Uh, what we're going to do, we're going to create a little bit of a, uh, a windowed floor, or a glass floor, I should say. Uh, that way we can still look down at uh, Jerry's grave. So maybe this first level is just going to be like the storage slash almost like a parking garage or a, a garage you would see on your house. There's not going to actually be living quarters in it. Okay, we're putting the glass down here. This is actually going to look really, really nice. Uh, I think this is going to be Jerry approved here. So let's go ahead and put that here. So yeah, we'll uh, probably do everything else in ladders. Uh, actually, you know what? I don't know. Maybe we will add another staircase in here inside the base of the tower leading up to the living quarters. Uh, I really wanted the, uh, the stairs here, but I'm not really sure about the next area. So let me go ahead and I think we're going to do the next uh, slot in cobblestone. That way we can mix the floor up a little bit. Uh, that way it looks like there's a decorative... Uh, brick around the uh, the glass here. So uh, can I clear this? Actually, we need to go one back here. So yeah, I'm gonna work on doing this base real quick, and then hopefully we'll start on the uh, the bottom bun here really soon. Okay, so I've started the layers of the bun or the bottom bun. Let me go ahead and I'm gonna layer out. Uh, let's try to make this look even. So I've got two layers of birch here, and oh, does that go over there? Okay, so I've got two layers of birch. And then we're going to go out one layer and probably that would be good enough for the bottom bun. So you can see how it skews out a little bit. So we're going to do it like this. Oh, let's jump up here. Oh man, I'm totally going to fall off this tower at some point, ain't I? All right, so let's keep going like this. There we go. Boom, boom, boom. So yeah, I've got to do one more ring here and then that'll create the bottom bun. Then I got to figure out how I'm actually going to do the next level. So obviously the next level is going to be the meat, which I've got a darker wood to use, but is that going to be the next floor? That's a good question. How big does this burger actually need to be? By the way, let's go ahead and get our torches out real quick. We need to light this area up a bit. Uh, let's go ahead and put lights here. You know, we haven't even lit up a Jerry's Memorial yet. Hold on, let's 
go maybe, where do we want these lights at? Maybe on the sides here. Let's go boom, boom, and boom, and boom. Oh, it's so beautiful. All right, so let's do this. I need to add also uh, another layer of fence down here. That way uh, it kind of blocks this off a bit. But yeah, that's a, it's glorious looking. He's all lit up there. Okay, so I'm out of spruce here, but I think this is gonna work for the bottom bun. So what I'm doing now, I'm actually working on the patty. So it's gonna be three across and probably two deep. And then we'll do a layer of cheese. Now this actually isn't gonna take as much as I thought it was going to initially. Because I kept thinking this was gonna be a solid object, but I'm like, wait, there's gonna be a house in here. So if we do two layers of the wood here, I've got some dye. I don't think I have enough wool to do a layer of cheese, uh, but we'll do that next. And then I think I'm probably gonna do like three layers of glass. I know it's gonna look a little odd, being that it's supposed to be just a solid burger, but uh, I wanna be able to see out of the house. And then maybe we'll do the toppings like the lettuce and tomato and then a top bun. So it's actually gonna be a fairly tall structure once you think about it. I'm excited for this now. I'm like fully pumped. So bottom bun, beef, cheese, windows, lettuce, tomato, top bun. So basically a burger dome. Okay, so real quick, let's go ahead and make our dye. Uh, so let's go ahead and put this in here. There we go. So we got plenty of yellow dye and this is gonna give us our layer of cheese here. So we'll put this wool in here and there you go. Oh, this is not gonna be enough at all. So basically I need to go find more flowers. Ugh. Yeah, it's gonna be really the resource gathering. Like once we get to the point where we actually build the inside, it's gonna be easy peasy, or should I say easy cheesy? So real quick, the cheese is gonna need to hang off another layer because your cheese is normally bigger than the burger itself. And I think one layer of this would be sufficient. So let me go ahead and just do one side to get a feel for what this looks like. And we'll go down and look at it from the bottom. Try not to fall off here. There we go. So let's go down here. Oh man, I can't get over how good uh, Jerry's grave looks. All right, so let's head down to the bottom. By the way, we do have more multiplayer coming up in this. I like to do these little build episodes because if I tried to build with the guys, I would get nothing done. And you guys seem to really enjoy these. That and you guys seem to really enjoy the llamas. Uh, hold on, let's go down here and we'll uh, see what this looks like from the bottom. Oh, I don't want to die here. Okay, come down here. Look at the shadow my tower makes. That's crazy. Oh, you can't even see it from here. Like, you got to be really far off to start to see the burger. Hold on, let's go down maybe to here. So, yeah, you can see the start of it. So, you got... Okay, I'm kind of getting a feel for how big this needs to be. So, there's the bottom bun. There's the meat. You have the cheese. You have tall windows. I think once it's complete and we have a really tall, like, top bun and dome it off, I feel like it's going to look good. Plus, I'm going to get rid of the ugly little bridge that wraps around. That was the, uh, the llama bridge. Uh, the thing's going to go here really soon. But, nonetheless, I'm pretty happy with the progress we've made here today. I kind of wanted to wrap up the Jerry situation and start on the, uh, the tower and let you guys give me some ideas for the Burger Dome. Uh, now, that's not to say we're not going to build above the burger. Like, that's going to be my personal house in, like, little uh, mini base. But if you guys have any ideas for other sections, we're going to build until it won't let us go any higher. Uh, which I'm hoping we got quite a bit of room up there. So, thank you guys for all the love and support on this Minecraft series. You guys are amazing. We'll see you guys next time.